My name is Dagoth Ur. I live at 308 Corpus Lane, Red Mountain, Vardenfell, 87104. This is my confession. If you're watching this tape, I'm probably dead, murdered by my sweet Nerevar. Nerevar has been building an intelligence potion empire for over a year now and using me as his dealer. Shortly after my 4,000th birthday, Nerevar came to me with a rather shocking proposition. He asked that I use my godly charisma to sell extremely powerful intelligence potions, which he would then create using his intelligence gained from drinking the same potions that he made out of netch leather and bloat, ingredients that were bought from one of the vendors in Genesis Temple. I was astounded. I... I always thought that Nerevar was a very moral man, and I was thrown, confused, but I was also particularly vulnerable at the time, something he knew and took advantage of. I was reeling from a battle I lost to the false gods of the tribunal that was poised to bankrupt my sleepers and ash slaves. Nerevar took me on a ride along on his silt strider and showed me just how much money even a small intelligence potion operation could make. And I was weak. I didn't want my worshippers to go into financial ruin, so I agreed. Every day, I think back at that moment with regret. I quickly realized that I was in way over my head, and Nerevar had a partner, a man named Fargoth, a businessman. Nerevar essentially sold me into servitude to this man, and when I tried to quit, Fargoth threatened my family. I didn't know where to turn. Eventually, Nerevar and Fargoth had a falling out. From what I can gather... Nerevar was always pushing for a greater share of the business, to which Fargoth flatly refused to give him, and things escalated. Fargoth was able to arrange, uh, I guess I guess you call it a hit, on my moon and star, and failed. But Nerevar was seriously injured, and I wound up paying his medical bills, which amounted to a little over 177,000 drakes. Upon recovery, Nerevar was bent on revenge, working with a man named Caius Cosades. He plotted to kill Fargoth and did so. In fact, the trapped chest that he used was built by me, and he gave me no option in it. I have often contemplated suicide, but I'm a coward. I wanted to go to the Imperial Watch, but I was frightened. Nerevar had risen in the ranks to become the Hortator of the Telvani and the Mages' Guild's Guildmaster, and about that time, to keep me in line, he took my sleepers from me and destroyed the heart of Lorcan. For three months he kept them. My ash slaves, who up until that point had no idea of my criminal activities, were horrified to learn what I had done, why Nerevar had taken our sleepers. We were scared. I was in oblivion. I hated myself for what I had brought upon my worshippers. Recently, I tried once again to quit, to end this nightmare, and in response, he gave me this. I can't take this anymore. I live in fear every day that Nerevar will kill me, or worse, hurt my worshippers. I... All I could think to do was to make this video in hope that the world will finally see this Argonian for what he really is.